Look at this, we now have a fully plastered room. Let's, uh, let's get a look around. And the walls are now extremely smooth. Um, the plasters did a great job. Uh, a bit of moisture kicking around, I've got a heater in here. Um, yeah, so I put out a call on Facebook to find plasters. I got about 12 people got in contact and I had a couple of them come over to give me a quote on things. Uh, one of them gave me a quote of £300, which was a little bit lower than all the rest. Um, I was fine with the quote, but really the, the thing I wanted was to have it done as fast as possible. He said he could come three days from then, and then after he left, he gave me a call and said, actually, I've got some time tomorrow, so if you want me to come tomorrow, I can do it then. That was an immediate yes. So he came in, this was yesterday, uh, and has plastered all of the walls. Very happy with how that has turned out. Uh, we currently just have a heater in here because obviously it can get very cold in here. Uh, and we don't want the plaster frosting over because obviously there's moisture content in this at the moment and that would ruin the plaster. So the heater is on at all times to keep this room pretty toasty. It's pretty toasty as we do. I'm gonna put a dehumidifier in here later. <laughs> the other thing you'll notice from me talking in here now, or at least I notice, is oh boy, the reverb is back. Oh, that is some serious reverb that we're getting in here. Um, but that's fine because uh, I'm going for the GIK acoustic panels, the, the treatment. I will be sending those guys the specifications for the room, where the desk is going to go, where my monitors will go, and I'll have them spec out what I need. Okay, so why am I here talking to you about the studio again? I'm talking about decoration now because obviously that's quite important. Um, and I'd really, really love your input on this particular subject because, um, you know, decoration is something that's personal to me. It's not personal to you guys, but you guys do watch my videos. Um, so your input is actually extremely valuable to me. I was going to run down the shops and get some mad black paint and paint the walls, uh, you know, do everything black. Uh, I'm definitely gonna, I think I'm gonna put the acoustic sound absorption panels up, have them mounted slightly off the walls and then backlight them with soft LEDs. So when, you're, when you see behind me, there's you know, something um, nice in the background. Of course, we're going to have some guitars on the walls as well, which will help. Um, but actually, then I remembered that in the last studio, I really liked the look of the faux brick, that kind of fake brick wallpaper that I had up. Uh, what do you guys think about that? I've gone against the idea of black now. I'm now looking at, you know, dark colours, but not strictly black. Um, that's still where I'm leaning. The idea of doing the walls a very kind of very dark grey. Uh, then with the acoustic panels over them for a bit of interest and then hanging guitars. I think that'll look fine, but I am not a man of um, appearance, shall we say. Uh, I don't really know what to do on that front. And yeah, your input would be extremely valuable on that, so do let me know what you think. Send me some links to, with some of your ideas, or even just links to other videos where people have a, you know, a background that you really like the look of, and I'll see if I can take some inspiration from that. So the other thing that needs doing in here uh, the floor, <laughs> under all this, this was, this was black long ago, but it's now got so much dust on it from the drywall um, that I need to work out a way of completely clearing this, getting this fresh. I'm going to go along all of the bottom of the drywall and uh, put in a bead of acoustic sealant. And then once the floor is completely cleaned, clear, I can then have a professional come and install a carpet with a heavy underlay to make up for you know, some of the bumps in the floor. Uh, I think that's going to be the best option and it's going to help absorb some sound because the thing I can tell you about the GIK stuff is that while I'll be able to cover the walls in panels, having stuff on the ceiling is not really an option uh, because the ceiling is currently that far above my head. Um, so I don't want things hanging from the ceiling. Uh, I'll look into it, you know, maybe thin foam panels that I can put on the roof that might, you know, that will help, that will certainly help. Um, but yeah, carpet, I think is a better option than wood because that will absorb some of our, our sound, some of our speaking when I'm podcasting in here. Um, but yeah, this is serious progress. I'm extremely happy with it. Would love your input, so please do let me know in that comment section below what you think, give me some ideas. We'll have Darren over again shortly to do the electrics and yeah, we are well on the way to getting this finished before Christmas now, and I'm extremely excited about that. So, as always, please do subscribe by clicking the button on screen. You can check me out on Patreon by clicking the button on screen, and you can also check out two more of my videos. Love you guys for all your support, it means a lot, and I will see you.
for another video soon. Laters.